Emirates unveils premium economy cabins at the Dubai Air Show. This year we have uh, our Airbus 350 uh, four classes, which is the first time uh, we're bringing the aircraft to the consumer, to the public to see it. Uh, it's an, we're adding into the three classes that we always had, uh, premium economy. This is a new cab cabin that will come in, uh, hopefully by someone next year will be launching it in 2022. The cabin will come in with um, and the 380 with 56 seats, uh, it has uh, a lay flat sort of bed, uh, sort of seating with uh, with bigger screen and IFE, with uh, 242 in terms of the, the layout, and it's um, and it's coming between the economy and the the, the business class, uh, which is a new segment that we are after to be launching by hopefully next year, and this will be more of like catering to anything beyond six hours of journey that uh, Emirates will be commencing uh, in the future. The work is going to be on the 380 to start with. Uh, six 380s uh, we initiated, but more of these aircraft, uh, the current existing aircraft that we have, the 380s and 777, will go through a major rate of it to increase the number of uh, the premium economy in the future. Saudi highlights its tourism plans as the national carrier of Saudi at the Dubai Air Show. As being the uh, wings of the Vision 2030, there is a lot taking place to meet those targets. So the 100 million tourists that will be visiting Saudi Arabia, Saudi has a, a major responsibility to actually uh, work towards that. And at the same time, it's, uh, you, you'll see that coming in as, as you know, coming out of this COVID era. Uh, so they will be building uh, capacity and uh, the, the right experience to, to make this happen. Saudi has invested a lot in that, you know, just over the past year. Some of it is, uh, you'll be seeing the actual fruits. We, we put certain uh, new uh, IT platforms available. There's a major digital transportation uh, transformation taking place. Uh, our loyalty program, Al Fursan, is actually going to be upgraded. And you'll see some of this coming in, in the next... Uh, year or so, in the next year actually, uh, you'll see uh, the onboard in-flight entertainment experience. Accor renews management contract for Mecca Hotel. Sanad partners with the Arab Air Carriers Organization offering its industrial service capabilities.